how much exercise do you do? I walk every day. Right. So I've, it varies. I, I have arthritis. That's one of the things I hadn't mentioned to, yeah, to your yeah. colleague. Um, and I find walking, I do what I can. Yeah. I do what I can, but it's not as much as I used to. So. And I have a replacement knee. Yeah. So it, Is that better? It's better than it was. Yeah. That was very bad. Uh, yeah. But I can't. I can't walk as I used to on it. Yeah. I can't walk the distance, which is a shame. Would you, you find that healthy eating advice would, would that help to support you to perhaps eat a healthier diet? If I was to be honest, I eat a, a healthy-ish diet. I just eat too much of it. I'm a greedy man. So what um, would what? I know, would, I know all the. So it's not a lack of knowledge. It's not no. It's it's not a lack of knowledge. Um, it's a, it's an inclination. I like my food. I enjoy it. And I like a lot of it. So how about having a smaller plate? I try that because I've seen research in that would in be, other countries that say if you give people a big plate, they eat more. <laughs> if you give them a little plate, they don't eat so much. Uh, I have actually heard that, yeah. uh, and it's, it's probably a good idea. If you know you ought to do it, but depression and loneliness and uh, things like that, and, and various uh, illnesses, it's, it's not just one thing that I've got wrong with me, you know, sort of thing. And is it the illnesses that make you depressed? Or a bit of everything. A bit of everything, everything yes. Um, when you see the doctors here yeah. for your physical illnesses, do they talk about your mind at all? Uh, I've kept away from the depression because they, I had a period when they were giving me tablets which yeah. made me zonk me out. They didn't and, help? Uh, they helped that, not as I do, you yeah. know, I really do know what I should be doing, you know, well, being I, positive, that sort I, of... I don't know anybody who doesn't know what, what they, they ought, ought to do, to do yeah. but they, lots of people don't do it, and yeah. the question is, how could we help that? Well, uh, th that, that's it, really. Uh, there are things, uh, like I'm making more... Um, Activities for myself like walking. Yeah. Or, you know, yeah. I've got a bike now, so yeah. I'm going to start riding a bike. They need to know that they're valued in society, and they need to know that people care, uh, and they need the right support. You know, either in the community or in hospital. How could we get them to feel that people cared about them? Well, uh, not beating them up, taking off the benefits, and not. Um, Making them feel like they're a, a, a what's the word a burden on society. Mm -hmm. You know, it's about finding out exactly what they really need rather than what we think they need. Yeah. So you know, and that's by having conversations with them. We need to you know provide more places in the community to support them. I'm not just convinced that being in hospital is the right place for them, but I think some of the work that's done in the community with them. It's more effective. Obviously, on the acute side, you've got to go into hospital, yeah, yeah. but you know, that and then we enabling and empowering people, isn't it? Yeah, you think the investment should be then around helping them to stay well mentally in their local community. Yeah, proactive, yeah. stitching time, isn't it? Mm. Nip it in the bud, deal with people before it becomes out of control and too big. But yeah.